How on earth am I going to do this now? my vlog from a few days ago you know that I went to Ikea to buy some things for my uni room and this is everything I've got and a couple other things that I bought online so I thought I'd go through them all and unpack them and show you everything that I got so if you want to find out what I got for my uni room keep watching so I think we'll start with Ikea first and some of the plants so I've got so the first thing I got is this vase of sunflowers I got two sunflowers because sunflowers are literally my favourite plant they're so pretty so I just had to get some for my room and yellow is my favourite colour so had to I also got some other bits of fake greenery to go in with the sunflowers in the bars because I thought it would just bunch it up a bit I think that looks so pretty put it on the floor in the corner of my room I think that looked really nice so each sunflower was £4.50 each and this bit of green was £3. The vase was £5 I believe, so not too bad. And they are of really great quality for fake flowers so I think they look really pretty in the corner of my room. Okay so next I got the, oh gosh, oh no, <laughs> it's just falling apart, oh my gosh. Oh, okay, oh, I think it clips back on. Oh yeah, there you go, good as new. Okay, so I got these two fake plants. This one, I think was nine pounds. So my plan for my room, there's like, there's a curtain pole screwed above the window with no curtains on it. So I thought if I hang loads of fake plants from it, it'd look really nice. So I got these two, this one was nine pound and this one was seven pound. I'll link everything down in the description so if you want to get anything you know where to go. And then to put them in and to hang them from the windowsill I got some plant pots. So I got these two gold pots because the plant of my room is like yellows and greens and then gold accents. So I got these two gold plant pots to put the fake plants in. This one's £1.25 and the big one's £1.75. And then I also got a little wicker one as well which I think was £3.50. I've got the receipt here now. Yeah, £3.50. Because I got two of them. Because as you can see, I do like having lots of plants in my room. <laughs> so I'm going to take some of the ones that are in this basket here with me. Because they completely sold out with the kind of darker green one that's in the bottom. Couldn't find them anywhere. So I'm going to take these ones with me and get some other ones to go in here. So I got quite a few pots for them to go in and I also got this hanging basket which is going to look really pretty with one of these in possibly this colour because I quite like how pale the leaves are on this one I think it'll go nice with the darker with the basket so pretty I can't wait to move everything into my room and just have it done now literally been looking online and planning things for weeks nothing else to do lockdown so Okay, so that hanging basket was five pounds. And then we've got oh, this <laughs> massive plant. This one's actually real. My mum thought I was ridiculous for getting this for my little uni room, but I really wanted it. So this is called Monstera Delicosa. I think I butchered that one, but. So this is just a nice big plant. I got a pot to go with this as well. So this was £15. I think it's going to look really nice in the opposite corner of my room to where the sunflowers will be. So I'll literally just be surrounded by green. I think it'll be so peaceful. And I got this big plastic plant pot to put it in. Obviously it's real, so it's going to have to be watered and cared for. So I thought I'd get it in a nice big pot. And I got white because the carpet in my room's grey. And then I have lots of green everywhere and some little yellow and gold bits. So I thought, nice big plain white plant pot. And then if I want to paint it, maybe spray it gold, I can in the future. So I think, I think this is £7. 
And next I got this flat pack wooden box. Doesn't look like much now, but it will when I assemble it when I get there. But I'm not too sure I'll put in this yet, but I thought it'll match well with the baskets that'll be hanging on my window. And I probably find some use for it, maybe put some plants in it or make up stuff or anything. But it's just nice to have a little bit of storage. So that was five pounds. I also got this yellow rug and this was eight pounds fifty. I have a sink in my room, so I thought if I put this under the sink, it's like something like so all the water doesn't get on the carpet. And I thought it'd look really nice and yellow. Honestly, you can't go wrong with IKEA for buying stuff for uni. Prices are so good. I also got this lamp, which was in my vlog when I went to IKEA, and this was seventeen pounds. So it's like I'll open this up so you can see if I can. <laughs> oh, bloody hell! Me and my non-existent muscles. Can't do it. Oh, hang on. Ah, uh, I was doing it wrong. Silly me. Ooh. So you can see it's gold. Because as I said, I'm having like greens and golds and yellows. So I think that'll look really nice on my bedside table. And it's like adjustable too. So I think like if I wanted. Ooh, if I just want to put it on and like turn it to face away from my bed so it's not too bright and then like turn it towards my bed for my reading or something I think that's really good. So only £17 thing is with unpacking everything for this video I've got to take it all down to Southampton so I can't unpack everything that'll do Okay, next we've got something also sticking with the green and gold theme. It's this little desk organiser. I'm trying to insert a picture of it all down here because I don't really want to... It's got lots of little bits, so I don't want to unpack it right now. But honestly, it was smaller in person than I thought it was after seeing it online. But I think it looked really cute like on my makeup desk. Maybe put like some rings in it or something. So I got that. That's £1.75 down for £2. And then I also got one of these candles. I literally have so many. You can see I love candles. I've got this exact one over there. And it's the vanilla one. It literally smells insane. Stunning. This is the 40 hour one. So it been for 40 hours. And that was £1.75. And then next I got this wicker basket it comes with a lid if you watch my vlog you would have seen me looking at all the wicker baskets and i did get one and if you watched that you'd have seen it was on sale so this was 12 pounds 75 also not sure what i'm going to do with this but i find a use for it i think that's just so cute i think that would be really nice to have on the floor under the window maybe yeah i think that'll look really nice in my room okay so next i've got some plates so i did i do have like the basic stuff because obviously I'm going into second year of uni so I've got most of my cooking stuff but I did smash my big plate before I left uni I saw these I thought they were really cute so I had to get them so this nice little square bowl this was £2.50 this nice little pink hexagon is hexagon? Hexagon, yep, yeah. quick maths. But this little pink hexagon plate was three pounds, so that's cute. I also got these two colourful spotty plates, which I thought were really pretty. But I've just noticed one of them was a chip. I don't know if that was already there, it all happened when they was in the car. That's alright. So I thought that's a really cute pattern on there. Nice pretty colours. So I'm not sure how much they were, can't find them on the website, but knowing IKEA's prices, they won't be too expensive. So then I got this pink dish scrubber, I guess. I had this exact one last year, but obviously it's a bit monkey now, so I got a new one. It's only a pound. It's got a little section on the end as well. And I got this mixing bowl, because I like to do a lot of baking. I do quite a lot of baking my flatmates 
in uni last year and they seemed to enjoy that. So I got a nice big bowl because I did have a little plastic one but it wasn't big enough so I got this nice big metal one now. This was £3. So what do we have next? We got these two nice big glasses. I did have a nice wine glass last year but my flatmate smashed it during pre's. You know who you are. So I got two new ones. This was kind of like more of a gin cocktail glass. And this is like just a nice wine glass because I do like my rosé, so I had to get these. This one's £1.75 and this one was a pound, so really good. We'll probably smash again by the end of the month, really. But got to get them. So the bag's empty now. I've just got my empty water bottle with it. And then I also got this insert for a cushion. I did buy a cushion cover which you'll see in a bit so I got this 65 by 65 we don't have a problem with the sizing because the cushion I got from H&M is 40 by 40 and there wasn't any 40 by 40 ones in Ikea but I do have another cushion cover which is 65 by 65 so I got that and I'll just use one of my other cushions to put the new cushion cover on so I got this for my other cushion cover this is six pounds Okay, so next we got a duvet. So, so last year in my student halls I had a single bed and I got this exact duvet but single and honestly it was just like, it was just such like a fluffy nice duvet. So I made my dad go up in the attic and see which duvet I got last time. And I got the exact same one but in a double. It's the Home Bar 12 Tox, so it's really nice and fluffy and big. It's way nicer than the one I've got here, so excited for that one and I'm really, I'm so excited to have a double bed now. Honestly, having a double bed at home and going to have a single bed. No, no thanks. No thank you. Double bed now in uni. Brilliant. Next I got this storage, some hanging storage to go inside my wardrobe. There's like I like to hang up like dresses and some tops but like things like jeans and stuff I just prefer to fold up like last year I just folded everything up on the bottom of my cupboard so I got this to hang up inside my wardrobe to fold my clothes on and it's got six little like compartment shelves and this was seven pounds so I think that's really handy to go inside my cupboard I just realized I got soil like mud all over my bed from where I got, had the big plant on. Oh, what did I expect really? Nia, use your brain, please. Um, oh. Bloody nightmare. Oh, I'm gonna have to clean my sheets now. You, you. Okay, so next I got oh this big mirror. It's quite lightweight. So in my room, like we've all got our own little sink, which is quite nice because my room, I got the attic room, so I don't have to be going up and down stairs all the time. So like I can just brush my teeth in my room and stuff and wash my face in the morning. So I got this mirror to like lean against the wall. I'll put a picture in of my room with the sink in it so you can see. I'm just going to stand this above the sink so I can like see myself when I brush my teeth. I think that's quite handy. That was £6.50. So next is something from H&M. It's the cushion I was talking about. Ooh. It's green with gold embroidery on it which I think is really pretty. from H&M Home. I think that's so nice. It's got little bees and dragonflies on it. Bees are my favourite animals. So I think that'll look really cute on my bed. I think this is my favourite thing I've got for my room so far. And then, then I got some more stuff from H&M. Two things. Uh, 
this one's the gold toothbrush holder that I got to go on my sink. So obviously I said gold accents in my room, so this will go really nice with the cushion and the plant pots. I think it will all tie in really nice together. So this was this was six pounds ninety nine from H and M. And then the other one is a soap dispenser I got, which matches it, goes together. So that would be really cute. I can put my own little soaps in it and then recycle the bottle. So this one, $9.99. It's quite a nice... It's quite hard to pump it. I think I'll be quite good actually because I probably won't use too much then. Very cute, very nice little set. We use this box to put stuff in to take on moving day. I think that would be quite handy actually. I've got no room to put anything. <laughs> Everything's all over my floor. Okay, so then last we've got a package from La Redoute. La Redoute. I'm not too sure to say that. Sorry. But yeah, I didn't know about this place until I started looking online for some nice duvet covers and things. So they had some really nice stuff actually. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I got, I think this is another hanging pan, if I can remember. I ordered it quite a while ago. Honestly, lockdown, things keep me sane is planning my uni room and just knowing I could move in. Something to look forward to. Oh, Come on. No. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I need to go to the gym. Okay, so. This, it's like a little rope for your hanging plant. I want to get quite a few more of these, like different styles, maybe something like beads on something to look really pretty. I would take that one with me, but it's like a ceramic pot and there's a really big hook drilled into the ceiling, which is holding it up. It's way too heavy to put on the pole above my window, so that's staying here. But this is, look how long it is. This is so cute. Got a little tass at the bottom. That's gonna look so pretty. I actually hang on, I'll put a plant in it so you can see what it looks like. Should I use a gold pot? Mm. Put that no. I think gold. Yeah, that'll probably look quite nice. Hot plant. I'll use this one for now. And then I think I'll use that big one in the bottom because this is quite a long one. I think that'll look quite nice in it. Wrap it around a bit. Honestly, I spent nearly 100 quid just on fake plants and plant pots in Ikea, so... Safe to say I might have a bit of a problem. Would you call it bother though, or would you call it taste? I don't know. Priorities. So that's what's going to look so nice. Obviously once it's hung up I'll be able to like, arrange it nicer. Look how pretty that is. I can't wait to put everything up. It's so tall. That's gonna look so pretty next to my window. And my room does get, when we went to view it, it was like the sun was shining right into my bedroom. It's gonna be so nice. So there'll be loads of sunshine and loads of gold things in my room. The sun will shine off then. And loads of green. That is gonna look so pretty. So this was, this was eight pounds. So that's good, eight pounds for that. And it's really well made as well. It's got a little, little hole there to hang it so I can slide that onto the end of the on the end of the pole to hang down. Love that so much. Really happy with that one. And then what else did I get? Right, bedding. Yeah that's it for me. So I got this nice bedding set. As I said I wanted yellows. So I got this really pretty double bed set. It's got really nice patterns on a little bit of pinks as well, which is okay. 
think that'll look really cute. It'll go nice with my rug. That's gonna be pretty. Um, matching pillowcases, I got two of those. And then a pink bottom sheet, which is the same pattern. So it'll all be nice and matching. So this was, the pillowcases were £5.60 each. I got two of those. The sheet, the fitted sheet to go on the mattress was £15. And then the duvet set was £28. So not bad, I think. That's just the one nice duvet set I wanted, which is a bit pricey. But I think I'll just get like a cheap one from Primark, which I'm excited to have two, so when I'm washing one, I can use the other. But yeah, that's all, that's everything I got so far. <sighs> now I've got an absolute tip to clean. My room's a mess, but yeah, it's nice to know now I've got, I think I've ticked off everything I need to get now. I think I just need to get like a cheap bed set, a couple more hanging things to put my pants in. Yeah, I think I'm sorted now to go. Moving in next weekend. So exciting. Some of my friends have like obviously on the first loads of people are moving in, so one of my friends have moved into their houses already and I see it all on Snapchat and it just looks so much fun. So I can't wait to move in. I'll probably do maybe a moving vlog or unpacking in my room so you can see how all of this looks once it's in there, maybe do a little room tour. But yes, yeah, is that's everything done, that's everything I got from my Kia and such. Hope you enjoyed. I'll link everything in the description so if you want to get anything yourself you can. Let me know what your favourite thing was. I think mine was either the, the like rope for the hanging basket or the embroidered cushion so I think they're so pretty. But yeah let me know in the comments which one was your favourite. Please make sure you subscribe and hit the bell button so you're notified when my next video goes up. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed and see you next time. Bye! Honestly this day all of my bed now. <laughs> no. Oh, this is what I get for getting a real pan. <sighs> it's cute though. No regrets. Look at the aftermath <laughs> for this video. Oh gosh. Stuff everywhere.